ladies and gentlemen my name is Razor and in the last video I titled Nardo Online New Player Experience uh, I got to level 15 and I got some ninjas for free um, off the clock I got a great ninja word Choji which you can get from clicking seven days and go to here seven days gift on day seven you'll get Madara uh, Edo Tensei, Edo Tensei. Um, so but for now you get great ninja word Choji which I'm gonna add him to the group because he's really good well for free to play anyway Obviously not very good if if you expect to be pay, pay to win. If you play any pay to win players. Um, he's best with the lightning main because of Ambu special assault. Uh, basically what happens is he takes a lot of damage. And every time he gets healed, here I'll show you on here, um, increases on Taijutsu attack and defense whenever receiving healing rate. And with Fonbu Special Assault, uh, he gets healed every, uh, every time he deals damage. And his attack is an AoE. It's like... I think it'll say it on here. Yeah, attacks the, attacks the entire entire opponent's team, so he'll get healed like four times, four, four plus times because he can also hit clones and stuff too. Um, and you can really get that you know the pass buff a lot with Ambu Special Assault. So he's best with the lightning main, but. I have the fire main, so I can't take advantage of that. But if you're using the lightning main, use Zombu Special Assault Tactics, I think is what it's called. And yeah, you can, he'll put in work with that. Oh yeah, we want to power him up to level 15 there. And things should be smooth selling from here. Should be pretty easy. They give you plenty of stuff nowadays, like I mentioned in the last part. And I was also looking at the power rankings for the server here. The person with the most power only has 10 grand. So either that's they're guaranteed not they don't they're not spenders at all basically that is what that means. They probably barely play the game I bet because getting 10k power is like uh, uh, you'll get that in no time like a week week worth of playing probably. It don't take long to get to 10 grand nowadays. There's so many ways to get power in this game nowadays yeah you want choji in the front row i'm obviously going to start with hashirama there and his uh choji's great into or choji's uh he'll heal before he attacks as well so he automatically buffs himself immediately So, but he usually, if he has higher initiative, he'll go first, so he won't, he won't get the heal off himself. See, so watch, he's already fully healed, so he didn't get, he technically didn't get healed there, because he was fully healed. And his chase that you saw there, the like boulder. Uh, if you have Ambu Special Assault Tactics, each of those hits will heal him, so he'll, he'll trigger that passive buff 
a lot with that as well. So yeah, just more of a reason you should have them with a the lightning main. Nice. So yeah, I'm giving the free-to-play experience a well done, honestly, because it wasn't like this one I played. I can tell you that much. You didn't get nothing. Like, guess who I would have right now if I was playing back in the day? Why isn't it showing Ninja on here? Oh, because we're in a battle. Um... You would have Sasuke, you would have Naruto, and you'd have Sakura at this point. That's it. Like, I'm not even kidding. Like, that's all you have. But we have Hashirama, Sen uh, Hashirama Senju, New Year Edition, and we have Great Ninja War Choji. And Great Ninja War Choji, look at his stats. Compared to like Nar, uh, compared to Sasuke, he's just like way better than Sasuke. So, yeah, they just give you a lot of stuff nowadays. I respect it, but you're still gonna have trouble later running into pay to pay to win players. So, but. I've said it before and I'll say it again. This is one of my favorite games of all time. But the pay to win ruins it. I spent over probably like two grand on this game. Probably all together. Um, playing for three years. And you'll end up regretting it. But considering the Chinese version still going... I don't see the, you know, they make a lot of money off the whales in this, let's be real. To probably keep this game afloat for years longer. It's still going to this day. I thought it would already be shut down by now, but the game is still going. And I literally just posted the Naruto Online new player experience, like literally like an hour ago and it already has 12 views, which is a lot for my videos. I'd be lucky to get 12 views in like 10 hours. So. That wants me to join a guild. I'm mean, obviously you don't, have to, you don't have to do that if you don't want to. Okay, this is very important here. So this is your dailies. It's kind of like... Let's see if I can fix this real quick. Okay, you can see it now, actually. Um, so yeah, dailies sign in. Uh, you have like timed events. I don't like this part of the game. I don't think any event should be timed. I think you should be able to do the events 24-7. I don't know why they have timed events in this game. It, it, you're only They're only hurting you know their player base when they do that. Because not everybody has time to get on when the events are active. You know I, I miss Sage World Battlefield so many times. Because... Uh, you know, I just wasn't available to play that at the time. And I'd forget, you know, like people forget. I, f I forgot all the time, you know. So I don't think they should do that. But yeah, participate in the arena. And just some credentials for me. I had over, on my other account I checked it, I had 190-something thousand power, which... 
before I stop, bef before I, when I stopped spending, I, bef like just before I stopped spending, I was one of the best players in my group. And then everybody just got above me because everybody just started spending a lot of money. And, but I was one of the best player, uh, the top players at one point. I was never like top 10 or anything, but I was like top 20, top 30. And in arena, in 2018 in arena, I reached Sage of the Six Paths every single month in that year. Okay, so once let's do some arena. Oh, we don't unlock that for until 21, though. So we can't even do that right now. Um, but yeah, I'll tell you the optimization of this game. It's really hard to record this game. <laughs> Oh yeah, make sure to claim this every day because you get 10 free coupons, which is really good. And also, make sure to go down to Recruit and do your free pulls. If it says free, do it. If it doesn't, don't. Save your seal sc scrolls. I can't stress this enough. The top up there, 30 seal scrolls. Save them until later. Don't use a single one of them until, the, in, until you unlock the newest treasure. Um, do not spend on this one here. Do not spend on the sealed treasure. It is trash. Save all your seal scrolls. I'm trying to find where. How do you get to the screen where you have your dailies and stuff? Magic training pill. I don't really know how to get to that, so I'm not worried about it. We'll just continue here. Oh, daily practice, there it is. Might be able to complete this now. We're going we're gonna to try this again here. We lost this in the last episode, but we're going to try it again. We want to target her to stop her... Upper barrier for coming from coming out. Maybe with Great Ninja Ward Chody we can win. Oh, we, yeah, well, I think we can win. Yeah, Lee is um, Lee is crazy. Lee is really good. He does ridiculous damage. So I tried to go after him, but I got locked down by Neji. It's over. Mm. We need to be stronger to beat that one. Yep, let's just keep going. Pot instance again. What does this mean? Okay, HP on or off. Okay, we'll keep it on. That's something new as well. That wasn't available when I played. They must have added that recently or something. 
ever since I last played anyway. I don't I don't want to say recently because Save the hairs. We also want to do the blue circle as well. People get mad at me if I don't do it. I got like a hateful comment because I didn't do one of them. How come you didn't do the blue circle? It's not that big of a deal, people. And the reason I didn't do it back then was because I wasn't powerful enough to complete it, so I didn't show it. And the one that I got flamed on was, it was the video is called Final Trial, Nardo on the Final Trial, or something like that. And uh, the bl I didn't do the blue circle in that video and people got mad at me. One thing Choji is, he has low HP, I will say that much. If you look at his HP compared to the other party members, he has pretty low HP. I do recommend Sasuke over Naruto. Uh, Naruto is more tanky, but Sasuke does more damage, so. Uh, and you already have a tank when Great Ninja War Choji, so you don't really need... You don't really need Naruto. But if you like Naruto more than Sasuke, feel free to use him. Now we'll go ahead and auto strength in here. You want to choose that, hit that, do not display during the session and then just go ahead and just power up do this every time you level up you get a good stat boost it does get increasingly more difficult or increasingly increasingly more expensive but it's totally worth it with a stat boost this is how you mid max in the game you should also make sure to equip all your Magatama on every character. Um, but you won't... Like I have this wrong. I need to put this all in my tank. So let me remove these and put them on my tank. You want the life ones on, the, on your tank and your, the defensive ones in your tank. Whoever you have in the front, basically. Because he's going to take a, a majority of the damage. And then after you have all your... St so after you have your life ones on your tank, your defensive ones on your tank, and your resistance is one... Oop, let me go back. Resistance ones on your tank. You could evenly distribute the other ones on whoever you want. So we'll give... A life one to Sasuke. And we'll give him a defensive one as well. To kind of boost his stats a little bit. Alright, practice in groups. Um, yeah, you could breeze through these plot instances. It don't take long at all to complete them. Especially if you skip the cutscenes. Should target Nardo there, but does not hit the clone. Shit. Oh, 
That's okay, we still won. In one round anyway. But definitely a misplay. You should always target somebody. Rookie mistake. Even though I'm damn sure not a rookie, I have 700 Nard online videos. money over here like it really matters it's not even really worth picking those up it's such a low amount that it'll never be it'll never matter I wouldn't even worry about the treasure chest either Trudy gets big. Like there's a chest up there if you want to go up and get it, but I'm not worried about it. It almost never matter. Yep, I messed up again. I didn't target. Wasted on clones. In PvP, you definitely don't want to make that mistake. In PvP, you'll just get wrecked if you do what I just did. And not, and not target. And I wouldn't, if I was in a PvP match, I wouldn't make that mistake. We'll target Sasuke here. Yep. I knew he was going to do that. See how fast that was? That took literally, I don't know, like a couple minutes maybe. Okay, we can get Hinata. She's not as good, of a, good as a, a tank as Toji though, so I don't recommend putting her in. Um, in place of Choji. If you have regular Choji, she's a better tank than regular Choji. But if you have great Ninja War Choji, do not replace her. Do not replace him with Anata. It's totally not worth it. I hope we unlock the wishing tree. Show you how this works. Okay, so you have these like bonds that you can get with people with your ninjas. You go over to them and you hit chat. And even though my earrings look ordinary, I mean much more than had uh, than that to me. So you want to kind of butter them up and like say tell them what they want to hear you know and then you'll get points is it for enhancing the bond between the Ino Chiki Cho clans I think we want to do the first one yep I picked the right choice and you'll get bond points Eventually you can simulate all this, but at first you have to, you know, answer them correctly. I'm not a fat pig or anything, I'm just curvaceous. Yeah, curviness. We want to pick the first one here, probably. Yep. And this will affect all types of Chojis, not just the regular Choji. It will affect Great Ninja War Choji. And any other Chojis that you get. Same for Inu. It won't just affect Inu. It'll affect in Great Ninja War Inu. And any other Inus. Same for Hashirama. This will affect all types of Hashiramas. Do you know what's the will of fire? 
in the first Okag he tell me. And see, I got 50 life for him. He got 50 life and damage reduction as well. And then also, you want to water the tree every day. And when you make friends, which I don't have any friends right now, you can water their tree and they can water yours and everything. And you can also select a friend and you can go on a mission and you get gold for that. And then there's also one more thing here. There's all, or actually there's the hot springs um, that you can, but you have to be level 40 to unlock that. And then there's also mining as well. You come over here. But you don't get that until a whopping 68. So we won't be able to take advantage of that for a long time. There's a people around. There's this person. 9,000 power. And this unlocks at level 23. Okay, training training inspection. How long have I been recording for? Twenty six. Okay, I'll probably go, I'll probably go for an hour. We'll target Sasuke. You learn the ninjas and you'll know who to target. I knew to target Sasuke because I knew they were gonna I knew the AI was gonna use Sasuke's mystery. Gotta take my medicine real quick. Alright, we'll grab a treasure. I obviously want to target that one, not the clone. Alright, clear. By the way, the bronze and stuff that you get uh, for completing plots instances are used to upgrade your equipment. And we can't switch our mains yet, but uh, eventually you'll be able to switch your uh, main. We're, we're stuck with a fire main for a while though. So it does not matter what main you pick, um, because you see right here, change class at level 60, so it's a long way away, but you'll eventually be able to change your hero. We'll go ahead and use those to get unbound. Right, level 19. We're almost level 20, ladies and gentlemen. And since we lived to level 19 with the main character, we want to also reach that level with the other characters in your party as well. So, eat a, uh, what is it, uh, whatever that is, rice ball or whatever it is. With all the characters in your group. Okay, 
And Sasuke gets really good. This Sasuke here gets really good, actually. If you get him up to, like, I think two or three stars, he gets really good. He's actually surprisingly good. He's actually one of the best early game ninjas. So that's why I'm using him, because I know how good he is. He's not good right now. Well, okay, he's he's relatively decent now, but he gets really good later, trust me. As a free to play in free to play terms. He's obviously not good pay to win or anything like that, but Alright, blue circle. You guys already know. Do the blue circle on all of them. Yeah, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna target anybody. I don't even know who to target in this battle. Didn't really matter anyway. God danger whatever he's saying I don't speak whatever he's speaking I guess Japanese I don't know I wish I spoke Japanese to be honest with you I just love Japanese culture so much like it's more to me than playing JRPGs and everything it's more than just that you know I'm just inter interested in Japanese culture a lot. And I do honestly believe that JRPGs are a lot better than regular RPGs. And I stand by that 100% without a doubt. And I'll never, I'll never think otherwise. I think JRPGs are better than Western RPGs and I... We'll say that with 100% positive, posi being 100% positive. If I honestly felt that Western were better, I would say it, but they're just not. JRPGs are just outright better. You can see the love they put into JRPGs. And it's not to say that they don't put a lot of love into Western RPGs, but it just, they don't feel the same. West JRPGs are more storyline focused. And Western RPGs are more free roaming. Like, you know, build your own narrative type of thing. There's more freedom in um western rpgs and there's in jrpgs um and i think it's good to have a balance like i feel like linearity is good not in this people always equate linearity as bad but i think it's good to strike a balance And I'm not really a big fan of like of how Western RPGs like how they do how they do it. They set it up to where you could do what you want, but then they have so much stuff you can do, and then it's like you get overwhelmed with a lot of the stuff. You know, like. Like, I remember playing Starfield, and there's just so much stuff to do. Like, it got insane. Like, I didn't know what to... There was times where I didn't even know what to do, because there was so much stuff to do.
Oh, battle on the bridge. I remember this one being pretty difficult. But it's not going to be difficult for us. Oh, yeah, definitely make sure to log in every day as well because if you log in a full month, you get, well, for in this case, you would get Susano Kakashi. But I obviously didn't start until, you know, the 20th, so I'm not going to be able to get all of his fragments. So, nothing I can do about that. I don't even know what this is. I guess we get experience. Oh, okay, so you do these missions and you get experience. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. Okay, I see how this works. and you level up and then after you level up enough you get the rewards okay I see how this works it's almost kind of like a battle pass almost and you get uh, I guess you get Ito Madara It's not bad. Pretty cool event there, I would say. I mean, this is a very infamous battle here. This was this was a pretty difficult battle back in the day. Sad music too. The whole storyline with Haku pretty tragic. It was a pretty good episode though. I mean, it was a, in terms of like, like, like it was just an amazing storyline. If you, if you watch Naruto, you guys know how good, good it was. It was, it was top notch, like storyline. In my opinion anyway. Yeah, see, look how much damage he does. Picks a lot of damage though too. But, yeah, that's pretty crazy, that damage that he was dealing. Battle on the big bridge. Play Final Fantasy V's theme on it. And you get Haku. Haku's really bad. Because Haku in this game cannot kill an opponent. 
and it makes sense because of Aku's story. So I love, I love that they kept it like the anime. Like that's so awesome. And Aku's pretty decent. There's nothing wrong with Aku. Aku has a water barrier as well. Level 20. And we unlocked... Something. Oh, we unlocked Elite Instance now. So Elite Instance will allow you to get Ninja Fragments. And elite instances, you don't have to like walk around, run around and shit. You just get fragments. See, we got Naruto fragments there. Really, a new event has opened up. don't honestly care. <laughs> we'll do some more elite here in a minute. Let's just, let's just set this here. Claim that. Claim some bond scrolls. Okay, we'll do this one now. <laughs> Transferred to her. She charmed herself. Way to go, lady. Choji taking out the other members of Ino Chiki Cho. The irony. Alright, we'll do the Choji one now. We have to do these for the storyline. about to be able to evolve Nardo here in a little bit. Yep, we can. We can upgrade Nardo. Watch this. He's about to get a lot better. And now he's actually worth putting in over Sasuke. Because we don't have Sasuke evolved yet.
So he's actually he's actually better than Sasuke. Oh, and we also want to strengthen our weapons or our equipment too. Haven't been doing this, but now I'm going to. And we'll do this elite instance. Kiba's not bad. As we evolve, or since we upgrade Sasuke, though, he'll be a lot better. He'll be better than Naruto. Okay, we've got some Sakura fragments. Go for about 13 more minutes or so. Okay, we can claim this. Okay, we can get, uh, what's his face, uh, yeah, Shino. He's not worth using, though. He's a decent character, but... Oh, now we can get this thing. And this is worth it here to get Gara. Uh, you don't have to spend months to get him, and he's he's really damn good. He kind of carried my lineups a lot of the time. Um, he's how I was able to get through the early parts of the plot instances because of how good he is. So if you want to spend a little bit of money and get him, you can. But I'm not telling you to do that. I'm not. I'm just saying, if you want to. There's poison tip. Every time you attack him with melee, you get poisoned. A singin. That's like the. It's like the Kamiyamiya of Naruto Online. Pretty iconic.
21. Oh, we unlocked arena. Oof. We can try out some arena here, but it's not going to go well. Um, because everybody's going to be using that Madara. That But we'll see. I'm assuming everybody's going to have the Madara. There might not even be anybody playing on here. I don't know. We'll see. It, it's also 2 a.m., so... Okay, we got basically the same lineup, except I have Great Ninja War. I think I already actually just won the battle because I stopped his... Oh, he did trigger a chase though. Target Hashirama because he's the most dangerous. Oh nice, it healed Choji, that's really good, so he gets a buff. I shouldn't be targeting him. Maybe I should have went through Sasuke. I think I misplayed not going through Sasuke. Should have got rid of Sasuke as soon as possible. And we'll go to we'll East Hashirama on his Hashirama. To stop the mystery from coming out. I should have went through Sasuke though. Should have got rid of him as soon as possible. Because he's the weakest link in terms of uh, defense. That was a misplay on my part. I think, yeah, we still won anyway. We can't win from here. He is critical hitting a lot. Oh, nice. We got a buff on Choji, though. Oh, he died anyway. It didn't matter. Nice. And there you go, ladies and gentlemen. We won our first arena match. Well, it's not over yet, but it's pretty much over. I don't think there's any way he wins from here. Of course, there's critical hits, man. What the hell does he keep critical hitting for? Getting lucky. Because stats don't, don't even set, set the matters on arena as initiative. And by the way, you have objectives as well. Um, So this one, you Sakura, and then you need two Wind Ninjas, so like that. 
Or wait. Oh, she's lightning. What am I doing? What am I talking about? We don't have a second wind person, so I can't even complete the other objective. So, we could do that, though. Probably better to protect uh, Sakura, though. Put her in the back. You want to have her protected so she can heal. You don't want her to get locked down. Are we talking the wind main here, I think? Yep. I picked the right one to target. I know how to play the game. I played for three... Uh, well, I played for three years in the channel, so... If I don't know how to play the game, then there's something wrong with me. I guess we go out to the wind main here. Oh, he didn't heal Choji. I expected a bunch of Moderas, because all the free-to-play players have Modera after seven days. Maybe this is a newer player. He hasn't played for seven days yet, somehow. That green, I think, prevents you from attacking on in this t on this turn. You can still use mysteries, but you can't do a regular attack. It stops a regular attack. Nice buff there, and then... I went after Nardo. I wish I went after the wind main, but that's okay. Does so much damage. But we won. There's no way we lose from here. There we go. Good duel, good game there. I like that was a good battle. And after you complete the objective, make sure to claim it. Uh, you can also reduce difficulty. Um, but you lose. I don't. You don't get as much. I don't have a lightning attribute one either, so you can reduce the one for that one as well. And just you just win without any... You get 200, you get half, but you can win with any lineup. And obviously we want Nardo instead of Sakura. I also want the mirror on there and 10 combo one. We'll get to one more battle here and then I'll end the video.
I do like Arena. Arena's pretty fun. Arena, you can actually win even if you're not a pay-to-win player. There's no pay-to-win in Arena except for initiative. And you usually do win if you have higher initiative, but it's not the end of the world. We'll see what he does here. He'll probably lock down somebody. Yep. Get a guy first, I guess. Nardo's gonna tank that. Clone's gonna tank that, so that's good. Come on. There we go. You have to use Choji's Mystery immediately because it won't go off if if you don't trigger it. What? Okay, it didn't work. His interrupt didn't work. Yeah, guy does have an interrupt, but it didn't work. <laughs> oh, Choji just died. target him. Okay, he's going to lock down my Hashirama here. We'll wait for him to do his thing. So I don't get interrupted. No, I'll interrupt his fire main there. Yeah, the ignite really did. The ignite really put in work in this battle. Ignite prevents him from healing, so it's really damn good. It stops healing. It's pretty crazy. Why do you target the clone? I targeted Sasuke. Or, not Sasuke, but Sorcery. There we go, we won anyway. Didn't matter. Yeah, we won 3 and 3, 3 and 0 in Arena. I still got it, guys. I still got it. Still, still pro. Nard Online player. You could tell all your friends how good I am. I'm kidding, obviously. Um, but yeah, you want to make sure to complete your dailies because you get a lot of EXP. Um, and you get Mount Me a Boku gifts as well for completing it. Summoning scroll fragments. Um, you get moon scrolls. Uh, you get group summoning chakra. That's only for groups. We can go to Richfields. It'll take us over there to it. I don't know if we can do it now. Or I guess we can. No, we gotta be level 23. Alright. Well, I'm in the part here. And 
Oh yeah, make sure to do this as well. We'll make sure to claim that. We're playing an hour. Hour. You play an hour each day, you get 10 coupons. Which is not a premium currency, but it's... It's kind of like a premium currency. You can use it on some, some things in the game. But not everything. And as for the store, you can buy, like... Go over to the Moon Scroll shop, and you can buy certain things in here. Like cave keys and stuff. Cloths, which will be useful later. Um... This is actually worth buying now, because this is just a direct power boost right here. Go, so you want to buy this Go Fukurama. Oh no, you have to get 50 fragments. Okay, never mind. Don't buy that then. Spend ninja test tickets in the ninja test store. Test out different ninjas. Hmm. I'd say the most power, or the easiest power thing is these. Mount me a Boku stuff. Um, it's, it's kind of the funnest. I would say the funnest power thing in the game. So if you want to spend on it, I recommend Mount Miyaboku because it's pretty fun. And it's easy to understand. It's not really complex or anything like that. Um, but that's it. Thanks for watching. Later.